Good morning, y'all. Good morning. Good morning. Great morning, y'all. I'm about to get my lashes done. Y'all don't even understand. Don't mind my hair because I've been flexi riding it and I'm not flexi riding it good. It's just everywhere. The hair looks healthy. Thank you, boo. That what they say this color gonna do. That what they say. But is that supposed, is that what's gonna happen? Hold up. Let me get my angles right because this is not it. That's not it either. I'm gonna have to hold it. Hey y'all. Oh God, no Draco. Yes, the lashes are in full effect. Let me put on the um. Let me put on the filter until then, cause. Ooh, baby, I'm not not I'm not about to need no filter. That's what y'all don't understand. Yeah, I could do the butterflies for right now. It's not giving me lashes, but it's giving me glow. Um, love the bouncy hair. Thank you, y'all. I'm feeling like mother a little Richard. They thought. Um, I'm gonna hate it. I know you are, Draco. Um, hey, real. I saw you in here, bro. What's going on, Rellingtons. Um, we want new music, Nick. Uh, hey, Mr. Dallas, I miss you. Guess what? New music is on the way. Don't even worry about it. I was sitting here listening to it, and I got on live. I didn't even know that the music not going to stop. I had to stop that for y'all for y'all record, for y'all screen record, and then to be on YouTube. And then I can't get my money. That ain't right, y'all. Y'all need to stop, stop screen recording these people lives. Girl, Bob, what, Nay? What you at the gym? You went to the gym today? Oh, yeah, I'm not at the gym because my hair, you know that, and I'm about to get my lashes done because I'm trying to be cute when we go out of town, too. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can't be the only one lashed up, wig laid. Me and Corey looking at this like, Corey, my trainer. You on live shaking my head. Corey, man. I miss the gym so much, man. I did 500 crunches last night. I swear, no bush. This is so hurtful. I'm sorry, Corey. I will be back right when I get from Miami. Um, Corey, hold up. You know what's going on. My hair was not this color. You know I'm not coming in the gym right now. Like, you want me to sweat my hair out? I did do 500 crunches last night. No, no bush. I am not lying. <laughs> I'm not lying. That's so funny. I just see you say that. I really, I'm really not lying. Like, I haven't been to the gym in a week, so I got on the ground and did 500 crunches. Cause I'm like, I need a a little fake ab. I ain't even hardly eat last night. Whew, y'all about to get me hot. Let me turn my air on. Cause I don't like people to say, don't think I be trying to work out when I ain't been to the gym. Y'all sound like my daddy. He swear I be fake working out, try to be cute in the gym when I really, you know, I be trying to get a little ab. So, yeah, Corey, if you still in here, I did me a little 500 abs. So, take that off my workout on Monday. I'll be back on Monday. I'll probably be back on Tuesday with the cap. Now, that's the real cap. So, I'm going to be back on Monday. I don't get back in town till Monday. So, I will be back on Tuesday, Corey. Corey, um... King of Fitness, he probably out of here now because he got to train they, because they fake working out too, talking about they working out, but they watching me on live. How that work? Somebody, why ain't nobody said that yet? Everybody want to come for me in the gym, but but watching me. Oh, that don't even add up. Uh, the lies, Auntie Sabrina. I would appreciate if you was on my side sometimes. Are you in LA right now? Why are you up? If so. And if you in Atlanta, that's fake. Because, you know, where you be at? Y'all, don't worry. It's hating on me. But what they don't understand is this hair is going to still be fresh when I get on that plane tomorrow. And when I go to the store today, there better still be gloves, Lysol, wipes. If I go to the first store I go to, I'm not about to be driving around to all these stores looking for lights on and stuff no no y'all do not eat chinese food do not eat chinese food i had chinese food the other day i threw it up lord please thank you lord thank you for this day thank you for waking up please do not let me have the corona amen
everybody should make their prayer today because oh don't eat that chinese food y'all i thought it was a joke it's not a joke it's not a joke it's not a joke y'all it's not no, I'm just kidding. I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. I really was throwing up. I'm, I'm making it a joke because I really, you know, I'm hoping like I'm okay. But it was really weird, y'all. I've never experienced that in my whole entire life. I've never got sick off of food. Like, that's just not me. <laughs> not what is wrong with you. Auntie Sabrina, I'm scared, baby. I was in the bathroom thinking I was about to die. Y'all don't even understand. Like, y'all, that Chinese food took me out man i was in the bathroom like these are my last moments and i'm home alone about to on the bathroom floor like that's not even cute like that's not even how i want to go out like corona no <laughs> lord please don't let that be my story i was so sad in the bathroom y'all don't even understand i was like i got to get to my phone and tell izzy he need to be on the way home right now the studio is over. Come home. But I couldn't get to my phone, y'all. I was throwing up so bad. I was passed. I was near passed out. So that's just my warning to y'all. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, we making fun of this stuff, but it's not funny. I could have been. Um. <laughs> not by get your lashes done. I'm about to get my lashes done, y'all. Yes, I was. I was on my bathroom floor like i ended up getting to my phone thank god after i threw up a whole bunch of times and i laid there like man i'm maybe dying. i got myself together and i got my phone that was literally a couple of feet away from me like i was looking at it like i can't even move to that phone because i may pass out trying to get to that phone but i got to it and i text izzy i said please come now and then he called me. I can't talk right now, boy. I'm boy. But somebody said, glad you're okay. Thank you. I really appreciate that. It was just a uh, one night thing like the Chinese food did. It took an hour for me, for me to feel like that after eating that Chinese food. And I feel much better. You know what I'm saying? I don't feel the corona inside of me. And I'm going to go to the airport tomorrow. I'm going to, you know, go on a little weekend trip. And nobody better look my way. Don't sneeze around me. Don't cough. When you come out the bathroom, if you're sitting next to me and you go to the bathroom, if I can't smell the soap from where I'm sitting, please change your seat. You did not wash your hands. Um, I just really hope it's Lysol and stuff when I go to the store because that's going to really freak me out if I go and there's not stuff. And my mom is where I'm going and she's talking about, oh, can you bring airs? Can you bring airs? I'm like, sure, I will bring airs or whatever. Next day, I call and I'm like, did you put airs on my flight? She like, girl, my baby ain't getting on no plane. Girl, people in the airport. Girl, nah, Corona, Corona. And she like, what time you get in? And I'm like, dang, what about me, your firstborn? I could be trying to get there to you. You gonna cancel Eris' flight, but just ship me off. It's just crazy how mama, how these mamas be working. You know what I'm saying? That's all I got to say. <laughs> mamas be, man, they be flipping the script. I thought I was love, man. I really did till she said that. Talking about, no, heirs can't come. What time will you be here? Yeah, Lee. Yeah, my nails. Oh, messed up. My nails messed up, but I'm about to get my nails on. Hold on, that's my last girl. Let me see what she said. Minutes away, y'all. So, y'all got like five minutes with me. Just drive there. Woo, baby. I can't even drive two hours without about to fall asleep. I'm not one of those people you want to like, oh, we can do a road trip. You can help me drive. No, that's not me. Mm, wow, you're here. 1B. I can't believe it. Morgan, I cannot believe it either. 
I really cannot believe it either. Speaking of my mama, she going to call me again talking about what color your hair? What color your hair? Let me see it. I take my bonnet off. She like, oh, you always got your hair up. Like, we can't even see it. I'm like, it's supposed to be dark brown, but it looks really black. She like, yeah, that's about one B. I told, I told people around me, you trying to be light brown, but they talking about that's going to be cute on me. <sighs> Y'all don't even understand. I don't, I don't compete with nobody with this hair. Only person I got to go back and forth with is my own mama. How are you still in my hair color before I can even get there? And they talk to everybody in the background. I'm like, but it look black. It look black. Black, I'm telling you, you might as well just do the, the light brown the light brown. The other day, she was just telling me she was going to be blonde and brown. The color I just got rid of. She's like, I'm about to go back to my blondes and browns. You know, that just look good on me. I'm like, yeah, do that. I'm getting rid of it. Whatever. Whatever. Here she come talking about, well, your hair is black. I might as well just do the little light brown for you. Girl, that's that's crazy, man. That's what I be saying. Like, these mamas, man. No, I'm just kidding. I love my mama. But, baby, you can see my mom is really my best friend. Because who do that? That's only something your best friend do. Like, dang, girl, I knew you wanted that color, but... I got it. You know how your friends be sometimes? You just be like, man, I got charged to the game, man. My friend got it. I can't even trip. My mama. I'm the goat of coloring. Thank you, Morris. But, you know, my mama would love to disagree. Um, Nice curls. Thank you, y'all. Let me tell you how I got these curls. Flexi rods. I, um, after I get my hair pressed, I flexi ride it every night, which my mom would try to say, that's stupid, that's stupid. <laughs> Look how I keep going hard on my mom, because why does she be going hard on me? She's talking about, why would you be flexi riding it? It's, you're supposed to wait till they get greasy. For one, I taught people, I taught my, my folks that. Or maybe I did. Maybe I'm taking the, maybe Tamara taught us that. When they get greasy, flexi ride it. You can keep the bounce a little bit. But I went on my own thing. I'm like, forget that. Look, I feel like my grandma here or something. But I'm like, yeah, like I could just flexi ride it as soon as I get out there. I'm going to keep the bounce for real. She like, girl, why are you got your hair flexi ride up? You don't have to do that every night. Just hating, man. Just hating. From outside the door, man. Can't even get in. I'm just kidding. Shout out to my mama because she been up early every morning. And she probably sitting here watching me. That's cap. She would have been commenting. The fact you color your hair, and, wait, the fact you color, wait, the fact you color in your hair healthy. Girl, that's, I'm trying not to color it no more. Hold on, what's on my back? See? I'm trying not to color it no more because I want it to be healthier. And, you know, I just feel like it could be, but I got to stop wanting to color it all these crazy colors every other month. Like, it's not healthy. It's not healthy for anyone. Uh, I wish I didn't feel that way. It's so bored. I wish I could just wear wigs every day. And my edges wouldn't fall out when I did. And you know what I'm saying? I wish I could just go back to my little sew-in. And my leave out wouldn't get thin. And then the rest of my hair be all thick. Here she go being a child. You know it. I am the child. Oh, wait. Yeah, man. Great Wolf Lodge is a really nice place to go with your family. Um, I'm not even going to lie. I don't like Great Wolf Lodge. It is a great place, Um, just in case they want to sponsor me. But my family has, you know, done it for me with great wolf lodge like i've been there too many times to know now that it's not for my age group you know what i'm saying um in lagrange what you talking about oh oh the great wolf lodge in lagrange i'm not sure but i know it's a new one out here that's not that far because the other ones are like two hours probably in lagrange i'm not sure i'm not sure you heard they have bed bug issues. Oh, no. No. That ain't 
ain't no LOL to put behind that. Oh, yeah, if we trying to get sponsored. That's what I like. My girl on the same tip as me. Yeah, LOL, because we don't know about that. We don't know about that. You know, Great Wood Lodge. I will have all the kids come if you guys sponsor me. I have a couple of young fans still. Some of them still watch the OMG Girls. Great Wolf Lodge hit me up ASAP.